What's going on everyone? Welcome to a brand new unboxing for Deadpool 2 Steelbook. Now first off, just so everyone knows, I also picked up some other things because I, I was shopping today. I found some other cool things. I want to show you guys them real fast before I get into this. Also, just so you know, giveaway. I'm going to be giving away the digital code for this. So I want you guys to comment down below and tell me what your favorite moment was from Deadpool 2 and which one you like more, Deadpool 1 or Deadpool 2. I still slightly prefer the first one a little bit more than the second one just because of some of the story issues I have with the second one. But the second one is still a blast to watch and I cannot wait to rewatch this film. But let me go into my haul. The first of two other Blu-rays I did pick up today was I actually picked up a 4K, which was Tomb Raider. I love this one. It's a guilty pleasure of mine. I have a ton of fun and it's 4k and i didn't even own it on blu-ray or dvd so time to pick this one up and i also finally got revenge this is a film i've been looking forward to i heard it's bloody i heard it's action and i am really excited to be watching this film soon picked up some funko pops because you guys know i love my funko pops and one is batman hush i was thinking this was gonna be bigger but it's pretty cool it's small and i can't wait to display it. i hope to get it in my background somehow because i'm gonna move some stuff around but this is a really cool pop so finally picked up the del toro director pop i pre-ordered this thing i'm so happy to get it i'm only missing two director pops now which is Paul Feig and James Gunn. So I'm hoping to somehow find a really good deal on those and add it to my collection of Taika Waititi and James Wan. And the last Funko Pop I picked up before we do the unboxing is Zero Zero with the graveyard dog house kind of thing. And I think this is really cool. It's a really cool one. 25 years of Nightmare Before Christmas. I know they have another movie moment coming out soon and I can't wait to get that one too. I'm definitely going to be opening this one up and putting it out somewhere because it's just really cool and it's cute. Let's get to the thing you guys have all been here for is the giveaway and the Steelbook unboxing. Let's get to it. Hey guys, so we have this beautiful steelbook right here let's get it opening all right so first off it comes with this little plastic slip cover which this is really different I've never seen a steelbook do this before because you can slip it up I really like that they added that to that so it says includes two versions theatrical and unrated cut which is the super duper fucking cut which is awesome um, so yeah, that's pretty cool. So let's slip it out of the cover. I, I really like that they added that. I'm gonna definitely leave that on there. Um, and then we also have, obviously have this, DP2. A lot of people said it looked like a children's drawing, but I really like the design for it. I think it's better than the original design, which we'll, I'll actually compare it real fast. Um, hot potato, really cool, really cool stuff there. Real cool stuff right there. So let's open it up. All right, so we have Deadpool, uh, new formats rock. We have the longer packed with pixels. We have just the regular Blu-ray and of course that. So let's look what's behind here for a second. Oh, so we got Deadpool running away. And what on earth could this dude be running away from? Let's find out. Ah, oh, it's Blind Owl. That's pretty cool. I dig it. I dig it. So a pretty dang cool um, little Blu-ray DVD kind of steelbook here. I definitely like this one more than the original one which I will show right now and we'll compare it to this. So this is the first one and I like it. It's cool. Um, it kind of annoys me that this thing's down below. Is this one down below too? Oh God, that's gonna annoy me. But yeah, so I don't, I, I like this one. I dug it. I just didn't think it was like the best thing in the whole world. I think this should be the slip cover on the outside, but I think I like this one preferably more, especially when you add this to it i just I, I just like it like i like to be on top obviously that like that, that's just super cool but i'm so excited to be watching this film again definitely some pretty cool stuff here i'm definitely gonna have to do a double feature today of the original deadpool and deadpool 2 and see how this holds up i need to get deadpool 1 on 4k though but man i'm just appreciated to have this really enjoyed the steelbook tell me guys what your guys thoughts are on deadpool 2 again leave it down below so that way i can throw you guys in for a giveaway to see who can get the digital code for this beautiful thing leave me a comment down below guys also make sure to hit that like and subscribe button to be entered into the giveaway i need to see that as well of course guys make sure to hit up sandwich on films also down below because right down there you guys can get into advanced movie screens you can also check out some movie news and also some movie reviews but of course until next time stay classy